Five years late, but five years more up to date. The Rijksmuseum is finally reopening on April 13th. Smartphones, tablets, state-of-the-art lighting are all said to have been employed in renovating the home of so many Dutch masterpieces. But Spanish architects Antonio Cruz and Antonio Ortiz started the project at Amsterdam way back in 2003. What took so long? Thorsten Gritschke has been looking at the nearly $500 million modernizing job. Thorsten, the renovation started way back in 2003. Why has it taken so long? Well, the details, Nick, um, are not clear, but what we do know is that Wim Pipes, the museum's director since 2008, has stated that completing the project involved solving a thousand dilemmas. Um, and what we do know is that in 2008, um, the original date for completion of the project, um, they reassessed what had been done and looked at the technological advances that hadn't been considered in 2003 when everything was planned. Um, so why, why is the Rijksmuseum quite so special, uh, Thorsten? Well, um, it might only be the, the third um, most popular museum in the Netherlands, right after the Van Gogh Museum and the Anne Frank House. But um, it is the National Museum. It's, it's, the, it's the pride and glory of the nation, and it contains about 8,000 works, uh, documenting 800 years of history, of Dutch history. And, of course, uh, everybody knows the, the Night Watch, and uh, famous paintings by Vermeer, like uh, The Milkmaid. Those are all in that museum, and um, it's a treasure. Well, we'll have to wait and see once it opens uh, next week. Thanks a lot, Thorsten.